smoke me? I'm smoking front red. Off. I'm smoking tough. They don't know outside smokes left. Fuck me, man. What was that? Once secret, like, like near secret. Yeah, we jump, yeah, we jump. Nice. Nice. Oh, oh, my my <laughs> oh, what is this? You're hacking. Esports is basically, in short, competitive gaming. And it could be on any scale, either small, as in just around your friend's house playing for something, either pride or something like physical money or a mouse, something like that. Or it could be something massive, like let's take Dota for example, where you're competing for like 20 million. So it can range, but in short, competitive gaming. So think of like your regular sports that you used to watch every day on the telly. Football, basketball, it's the same, it's just a bunch of indiv individuals just competing against each other. So the society started before I was at uni. It didn't actually, it wasn't always called the Esports Society. Originally it was called the League of Legends Society. In the first year not too much happened, but then in the last two, three years we've then um, started talking to sponsors and it's all developed a lot more. And in the last year or so, two years, we've been the biggest society on campus. We won Society of the Year two years ago and uh, hoping to continue that, make, sure, make ourselves well known. It's like in football I enjoy, like you get kind of thrill when you score a goal or when you dribble past someone or something like that. And that's similar as in esports, you get the thrill when you kill someone or when you win a round or when you win a game. To be honest, most of my friends I have right now at the university are all esports related. Because everyone, it's just a, such a huge thing that when you start playing games with people, their friends are with people, and their friends are with people and everyone sort of can easily come and join and play a game together and that's why it works so easily. For me it's been a family, friends that I can always rely on. I can message them and say, oh, I know it's, it's nothing to do with gaming but um, do you guys want to cook dinner or something? It's just become something like that and that's the beauty of the society. It's just, you know, the, there's so many people joining and it's up to them whether they want to come and, you know, hang out and it's just the perfect place for them to, you know, be themselves and I think a lot of people find that really difficult sometimes to just kind of spread their wings. Esports in general is only going to get bigger. It's definitely one of those things that's on the rise completely, especially within the university scene too. I think it's only a matter of time from a university picking up and making it an actual thing, sort of like a sports village where esports has its own sort of entity on campus and it's the university owns it rather than society running out.